how to search and filter Amazon brand analytics keywords. Now, why is this important and how can it make you money? Well, if I'm going to look into getting into a new niche or trying to understand what's going on in my own niche, whether it's for my product or for my competitors, this is actually a great way to find top keywords that maybe I might have missed. It can help you uncover important keywords before you even start your listing and it can show keywords that are driving sales for your competitors. So let's go ahead and take a look at how to do this. So um, what you're going to do is the first thing you want to have is a an ASIN. And so what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to go ahead and I'm going to go to Amazon and I'm going to pull x-ray. Okay, so the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to copy an ace in here. I'm just going to copy our coffin shelf in here. And all I'm going to do is I'm just merely going to apply the filters. And you can again, um, at the top, you're going to choose whatever week you want to filter through this info. But what I'm going to go ahead and see, okay, so we've got coffin shelf. Um, this is this is going to show me the top keywords for this particular or top for my product that I actually put in there, whatever it's your competitors, or it's your product. So if I take a look, it looks like we've got only 11% of the click share and 0% of the conversion share. Whereas this one, they have 18% of the click share and 30% of the conversion share. So this is going to show me maybe there's something that I need to be doing um, in terms of this. But um, another thing that you can do is you can also just put like coffin shelf in here to see if we can find anything that's similar to coffin shelf, or you might even go broader. Okay, so we've got coffin shelf large here. It looks like um, I am right here. We're at the 11% click share, whereas the competitor is 13%. I'm not getting any of the conversion share. They're getting all of it. So what I think this can actually tell you is, first of all, it can tell you some keywords that maybe you're missing that maybe your competitors are actually capitalizing on. And now this is different per week. So you might want to go through this every week. So you'll find where they're kind of converting higher or where they're getting most of the click share. So then you can kind of take a look at maybe something that you're doing. Where is my competitor getting all the click share and I'm not? Why am I not getting the higher conversion share? Um, you can also find keywords where you might not even be getting any of the clicks at all. So this is a great way to find those opportunity keywords using brand analytics. 